So looking at the criteria, a question that's very, very often asked is, what is the best schools out there? And many times uh, we get quoted, is, is, is it Henrietta Barnett or uh, QE Boys, Queen Elizabeth Boys, because they are considered to be the, uh, the, the most academic uh, state selected schools in the country. And if you look at the league tables, they're at the top year in, year out. You could also look at the private sector with schools like Eton or Westminster or St. Paul's or North London Collegiate School. Are these the best schools? And Lorraine and I feel very, very strongly that no is the answer. They are indeed the most academic schools, but that doesn't mean they are the best. We are very, very child centric. And we believe that the best school for any child is where they're going to be happy and where they're going to reach their full potential. Next slide, please. So where's the best school for your child? Where they're gonna be happy and where they're gonna reach their full potential. Where the question comes into place and indeed whether you should be sitting your child for the 11 plus is having that background knowledge based on your child's ability and your knowledge of the child of what is their potential and what type of school is going to be the right one to allow them to meet it. 